the eve of America's birthday, a faith group of pastors and ministries from across the upstate are asking for unity in our country. The Concerned Citizens of Faith Outreach hosted a vigil tonight to pray for family, community, race, equality, and world peace. Fox Carolina's Matt Koufax was at that vigil and spoke with some community leaders. He joins us live in Greer with more tonight. Yeah, Tori, organizers I spoke to say that the timing of this vigil, right as we gear up to all celebrate our country on the 4th of July, really heightened their message today. They stood right here and a little bit behind me asking God to help heal America's deep wounds. Minister Dietra McLean says they weren't just praying for Greer or the upstate today, but a nation in turmoil. All the tragedies through racism and through division that has occurred within our land. McLean, who is from Falls Church Grove Baptist in Cherokee Springs, says even as we gear up for the most patriotic of holidays, we should still be mindful there are those fighting for a different kind of freedom. Trying to receive the equities that every individual is deserved or deserving of in America, it's different that there's still not that full freedom that we celebrate on uh, July 4th. There's still so much work that has to be done. In light of George Floyd, a wider observance of Juneteenth and what she says are meaningful strides made, the education about inequality in America must continue. Sometimes when there is a misunderstanding or it's been miscommunicated through the years, that is where you have that division or that hatred or discrimination. I believe that the answer to our problems today in the United States, in the world, is prayer. W.J. Teasley, a minister with Mayfield Chapel Baptist, is also the president of Concerned Citizens of Faith Outreach, who hosted the event. We're not here for no other reason but to talk to God about the situation that's going on in this world right now. Today, he brought ministers from all over who one by one recited powerful prayers of healing and unity. Teasley believed faith will see the country through. The only way that we can be like God is love. You know, they don't say love certain people or love that person and don't love that person. We have to love everybody. Leaders I spoke to say they hope everyone has a great holiday tomorrow and that they hope also that we don't lose sight of the work that needs to be done amid the celebration. Celebrations, though, they say that can happen because they are so thrilled with some of the progress that has been made in these last few months, progress that gives them a lot of hope for the future. In Greer tonight, Matt Koufax, Fox Carolina V, 10 o'clock news.